These are like the gods, if you like, that organize and uphold and maintain the structure of everything in creation. Well, I love this knowledge of Vedic science and I love painting and I'd really love these two things to come together. So I started very innocently, very simply and straight in a straightforward way with figurative work. That is observing the outside world and recording it as accurately as I can, developing all those skills of mind-body coordination. And then eventually a point came where these figurative, more surface textures of the thing no longer, it's like, it was like that process had run its course and I'd, I'd done all I needed to with that. Now I needed to plunge into these deeper structures of reality. Eventually I finished up with just working with these geometries, these pure geometries. Initially it was just a grid of squares uh, and interlocking forms on those uh, within those structures, which I finished up just working with these square grids for about a year and it was a completely exhilarating experience. I, I didn't need to refer to anybody else. I was flying on my own now. I, I, although I didn't know quite where I was going, I knew I was going in the right direction and I had all the exhilaration that went with that experience. And then at the end of that year, then these whole images, these absolute images started to come into mind. And then it was just a matter of, I knew that this is what I'm supposed to be painting and I just had to figure out how to paint them. My paintings are built out of five fundamental geometries, which are the point, the line, circle, equilateral triangle, and square. 